this whole thing, like, like this whole thing, this is the whole head. And then you got your eye, your eyelashes, and your brow, and then you got your eyebrow, your mood, and then you got that crazy looking hair, you know. And then you got that scary looking mouth with full of teeth, and it, it has, it can, that's it, it has, he he tongue. And then you got your nose, and then the tongue, and then the, the ear, and then the other ear, and then the pupil inside your eyes, and then the little hairs on in your eyes, and then you got the eyelash, eye wicks, nosebleeds, and nose holes, and all sorts of stuff, and blood, of course. And there's not a lot of things to mention about your face, you know, like, kind of crazy. Why do you need to mention your face? Well, let me, let me just put this up in order, okay? So let's talk about all the way to your hair, which I bet looks different from everyone. So I'm just going to talk about my hair. So... When I was growing up, uh, well, I'm not that big, you know. My hair's like, eh, you know, pretty long. Not, not like a girl's type stuff, like you see these things still, you know. And I don't know why my name is called Nick. Look at the translates. Great, that's great to see. Okay, what, what kind of name is that? I wish I had a name like, uh, what else? Nah, I don't know. Now, moving on to your forehead. And I bet your forehead has your smarty pants brain. Uh, yeah, your brain is smart. You use it for everything in your whole wild life. Now, moving on. Your eyebrows. I mean, your eyebrow is probably stuff like, uh, uh, and then now, like, I know this is like skin, and then, yeah. and then moving on to your eye. Uh, you have your people, the hairs, no, not the eyebrows, the hairs and stuff, eyelash. And done. Now moving on to your nose. Uh, which I'll talk about nose being in a second. But nose is part of your sense. Please. And this thing has a very small spot. And by the way, it has blood vessel. And if you pick your nose, that blood vessel will break and then. The blood vessel has blood in it, and then it flows it out. And it also depends on the weather. Now, moving on to your lips. Let's check it. Yeah, the lips can be pretty tough to mention all the time because, you know, human body isn't just like normal to ringless. Blood bath bumps. Uh, yeah, pretty sure. So, uh, topics. Oh, this is it. Now, we'll be inside your lips as the teeth. The square shaped teeth. And now, the head, the tongue. And then way back the tongue is a throat and the neck. And by the way, you can you can say these two are like oh by the way you have gum. And your tongue has taste buds. Well, I know, you just can't hear me probably saying stuff when I got my tongue out very bad. I think that's
that's it. Oh, next time I'm going to talk about five senses. Love you. Yeah. Bye. Or maybe gloves.